Welcome to the travel vlog. I am currently in Miami right now. We flew here from California and then the next day we were supposed to fly, which was yesterday, to Paris. We're at our friend's house right now. But one of the pilots had a family emergency, I guess. We don't really know what happened, but he literally like an hour before we were supposed to go called or someone called and said we couldn't go. <laughs> so that was a really sad moment. And now our trip to Paris is only gonna be one night. So yeah, now we're only gonna have one night in Paris, but it's fine. We're gonna make the most of it. We're gonna arrive in Paris really early in the morning and have one night there and then leave the next day to Saint Tropez. I mean, first world problems, it's we're, we're leaving today instead. So we just got back from Whole Foods. We got a bunch of stuff and food for the plane. It's about a 10 hour flight. We fly to Maine and then from Maine, we fly to Paris. So I think we just stop up there to get gas and then we fly across the ocean. Yeah, I mean, should be fun. Obviously taking you guys with me for the whole thing. But for now, we're Miami. We're leaving in about 20 minutes for the airport. This is my view right now, by the way, look at this. This is my view. So pretty, it's such a nice day out today. Just doing some last minute packing and we're gonna head out. Let's go to Paris. <laughs> We just took off and I just made a charcuterie board in the sky. I, I'm just a pro charcuterie board maker. We got all the stuff. I'll show you. Well, it's probably half eaten by now, but I'll show you the setup. We got a little bed. This is our bed. My charcuterie board. Wait, hold on. Here it is. We just made it to our room in Paris. I'm doing my makeup and I need to show you guys a hotel room tour and show you the setup. We're about to pop some champagne and make mimosas because it's, well, it's actually probably like noon right now, but we landed a little bit late. I have to do a, t a story time on what happened while I get ready, but first I'm gonna show you guys the room. I booked such a good room. <laughs> this hotel is so cute. Okay. This is where you come in from the door. You don't have to hide. Um, we got a mini bear, mini bar. This is the situation. We got a little hallway. Cute little things on the wall. Um, and here is just the closet and the bathroom. All marble, super cute and clean. This closet is so big and so new. And then the cute little Parisian. Oh, I just love the vibe. It's so cute and classic. And then the best part, also they got us champagne and some plums, how cute. So we're gonna make mimosas. Do we have juice? We have mango and apple juice. Okay, this is the view. This doesn't seem like anything at first, but then, whoa! <laughs> it's so fucking cool! This is crazy. We have like all the shopping area down here. The freaking Eiffel Tower. Like, are you kidding me? 
That's gonna be so pretty at night when it lights up. All these red flowers are so pretty. Anyway, let's pop the champagne. <laughs> Woo! Paris! Paris, we made it. Mimosas. I'm so excited. We only have one night here. Wow, it's tasty as shit. Thank you so much. Maybe a splash of apple. Okay guys, what is up? Getting ready. I have to tell you what happened. It is currently 1237. We were supposed to get here way earlier, like 9 a.m. But we, I told you guys we had to fly to Maine to like gas up before we, we crossed the Atlantic Ocean. And when we landed in Maine, the pilots were like, we just got to check something with like, I don't know, outside of the plane. I'm going to show you the photo. Also, my dad's an airplane mechanic for 30 years. So I like <laughs> sent him photos of this and he was like telling me. But like, it was just this little thing outside of the plane. These little holes here. Apparently like something was in it. I don't know if it was mud or a bug or a fucking lizard. I don't know what it was. <laughs> the story kept changing. But apparently it was like, malfunctioning and that is how they know like the levels of compression I guess or like the altitude levels and they kind of just like need to know that if they were going anywhere else they said not over the Atlantic it wouldn't be like an issue really but they just wanted to be super safe so they had to like do like a whole ass test takeoff and landing it took like two hours we were there in Maine for like two hours they did a whole takeoff and landing just to make sure because they were like it malfunctions at like 10,000 feet so they did it and it all all was fine, thank God, or else we would have had to stay overnight in Maine and then have some mechanic crew come and it would have taken like half the day and we would have totally missed Paris and that would have been so sad because we already missed a day here which is sad enough I guess it's first world problems but I freaking love it here just like driving to the hotel made me so happy everything's just so nice so I'm excited to explore we're I'm getting ready I'm gonna curl my hair and we're gonna go to lunch hopefully get some cute photos because I have so many cute outfits to wear here it's just like too many for one day and we have to leave super early in the morning to go to Saint Tropez because there's like a bike there's like a bike thing going on <laughs> what's that called not a marathon but for bikes you know cycling I don't know I'm blanking I'm really tired I'm super jet lagged but it's okay we're gonna pretend like we're not yeah welcome to the Paris vlog so I'm gonna get ready and do a little time lapse and drink my mimosa <laughs> updated you guys all day. This is Sierra, by the way. We're Sierra squared, two Sierras, we love it. Um, but we're at the Louvre. I haven't updated you all day, but all we've done was get lunch and we shopped a little bit. I was gonna buy a purse, but I didn't have my passport on me and you need your passport to get like tax free. So it didn't happen. the next morning I don't know how much footage I got yesterday but we just ordered room service and it's the cutest little setup ever I'm show you guys. we got waffles croissants eggs crepes and toast so we're gonna eat this real quick because we're running late and then we're off to Saint Tropez one last look at the view oh this is my outfit all from Revolve What's up guys, so we just landed in Nice and we're about to take a helicopter to Saint Tropez. Yeah, that's what's up. What's up guys, we're in a helicopter. Me and my Sierra, my second Sierra are in the front. a couple days into Saint Tropez. I haven't vlogged, obviously. I will tell you a story time later on today, but we're on our way to Dior Cafe. It's like a cute little cafe. Are we going? No. We can go in Dior. We're going to the Dior Cafe, but so I needed to vlog that. Yeah, that's what's going on. This is the fit.
What's up guys? So it's actually the next day. Oh, I've been struggling with the vlogs here in Saint Tropez, you guys. Yeah, I don't know. Things have just been like go, go, go here just because we've been doing so much. Well, I don't know. I think it's just because I take a long time to get ready and I just have been trying to get content for like brands that I have to do and it's just kind of been crazy with getting ready, going to do stuff and be like social in the moment and then take content for brands and Instagram and all that. Anyway, it's whatever. I shouldn't be worrying. I'm enjoying myself. It's been very fun. We've basically been uh, two of the days. We have gone to like the lunch, like beach club things like Nikki Beach and Bagatelle, which are very fun. That's what we're doing today. Again, one of the days I was very hungover. Okay, yes I was. And we literally just sat down at the hotel pool all day, but I just like looked like shit and I was not feeling very good. This was the day after Nikki Beach. And then um, yesterday we went to the Dior cafe and then I don't know why I just forgot that I was trying to vlog that so didn't get much footage there and then we went out that night so it's just like Saint Tropez is the party destination of this trip along with Mykonos so those two I don't know Monaco we're going to next so I'm gonna combine these vlogs hopefully that'll be more chilled Monaco's very bougie and like all about the nice cars and the big yachts and everything. You'll see that when we get there. Hopefully it'll be less party. I think I was just struggling after Nikki Beach. I really, I got, I got very drunk there, you guys. Okay, I'm not going to lie. I got some Instagram clips there, I think. And it's just like a whole other level. It's so fun. It is so fun, but I did end up crying at some point. I thought it was, I got drugged, but I, I don't think I did. I think I just took like eight shots. Um, I don't feel like I ever talk about taking a lot of shots or drinking on this channel, but you know, girl loves to have fun. So did that, did end up getting kicked out of the parking lot. The whole day was, it was fine. It was fine. Nikki Beach was fun. We ate, you eat there and then it's like a big party. And then it started getting fuzzy at the end and then we were leaving and then, I mean, we were leaving anyway. So I guess I didn't really get kicked out. I've never been kicked out of anywhere, but I, I was probably, I wasn't wearing shoes. I was a little messy. I don't really know, but I do remember a security guard escorting me away and around the corner from everybody with my friend Sierra, who's also here. My boyfriend made sure I didn't leave anything and that was very nice of him and made sure that all my expensive things were here, my sunglasses, I didn't have shoes and my bag. So he brought them like right away and it was fine. Then we got in the car and went home, but it was funny. I don't know. I think it's just an interesting story because I've never been kicked out of anywhere, like because I was too drunk. So, you know, gotta do it once in Saint Tropez is a good time to do it, I guess. Anyway, so today we are doing lunch at another place and I'll try to vlog you guys, but I cannot make any promises. Also, I want to kind of film around the hotel at some point because it's so cute. Look at you guys. Look at where, look at where I am. It is so beautiful. I'm looking at the ocean. Let me show you the ocean. This is the pool we were at when I was hungover. <laughs> look at how many yachts there are, you guys. It is packed. And these are all the beaches, like the nice beaches we're going to today. Yeah, I'm just sitting here. Look how pretty these chairs are. Yeah, so the place we're going to today is kind of like a boho beach restaurant club thing. So I'm kind of just wearing this. Honestly, just wearing the golden gooses. And I brought these though, just in case. But honestly, rocking the golden gooses, I think. I don't know if I like this outfit, but I kind of just threw it on. Anyway, that's about it. We're gonna get food now. We haven't even had breakfast and I will update you when I can. <laughs> Love you guys. Quick change of plans. We came down to the pool to eat. Waiting for food. I forgot to film our food, but I got the club sandwich. This is the best freaking club sandwich I've eaten in my whole life. It's just so good, I don't know. And then, this looks like shit now, but we had a burger. Wagyu burger. The food is so good here.
it's the next day and we're leaving Saint Tropez today and we're going to Monaco we're on a boat and I'm so excited. We're down at the port. All these boats are crazy. Let me show you guys. All these boats. This one is insane. We're headed there on this boat, loading all the luggage. We have so much luggage. Finally, I'm not gonna lie. We've been here for mm, Like four days. How many days have we been here? We've been here for like five days We only have basically a day and a half left. Yeah, so I haven't vlogged since um, Like Saint Tropez. I did not vlog the only place I really didn't vlog is Monaco because we were there for two days and it was very rushed and like we didn't really do much so didn't vlog there but it was really cool one of my favorite places honestly and I just haven't gotten around to vlogging Mykonos yet but I am vlogging it I'm here in a hotel I'm gonna do a little tour for you guys it's literally just been bus club another club another club next place no sleep vibes this whole time so it's been a lot. I'm slowly dying, but it's been fun. It's been fun. Um, so yesterday though was me and my boyfriend's anniversary. So we checked into this hotel. I've always wanted to come here. It's the one on Instagram. It's very Instagram-y. But anyway, we got this hotel. Like I don't even know how because everything is sold out. Somehow my boyfriend managed to finesse. We got this amazing room last minute for one night just to get away because we're actually staying in a villa with like a big group of people, which I'll show you that too later today or tomorrow morning. We wanted to get away for our anniversary. So this is the hotel room. I'm gonna do a little tour of the other bathroom. Also, it's really messy because it's the next morning. So we're about to go to breakfast and hang by the pool. But yeah, so the room's like, we've slept in it. I'm ready for the day. But when I walked in, there's all these rose petals. So romantic. But we messed it up. It was all cute before. There's a lot of fruit that we didn't eat also, which is really cute. We got a balcony over there. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> um, that's the entry. Rose petals and candles. We got a closet. We got a TV. We got... There was rose petals all here. But this is the view. That's the like main pool where we're going right now. And then we have our own jacuzzi and a big ass balcony out here. We're gonna go eat breakfast down there and hopefully get one of these little day buds. But yeah, we went in here yesterday. It was really nice. We have our own little day bed here. And then yesterday there was all these cruise ships. It was really, really cool, but they're gone now. And then over there is like the main town, and then this is all the hotel. This is the vibe. Uh, let's go get breakfast. Also today we're going on a boat, so that's why I'm vlogging also, because it's exciting things. We're going on a boat. Okay, bye. <laughs> On the boat, I changed into my little outfit. I just bought this.
What's up guys? So I am in Amsterdam now actually. I never ended up vlogging the villa or anything really else in Mykonos because we ended up having to like rush out of there and get like a hotel for one night because we didn't realize we didn't extend it long enough. So it was really hectic and couldn't really vlog and it was really just hectic. So anyway, yesterday we arrived in Amsterdam and we did a little shopping, had a little lunch and went to a cool dinner. It was like a bar dinner thing and then just explored it was really cool we're staying at the w hotel so we leave today finally to go back home i'm pretty excited this trip was super long but super super fun but yeah it's always nice to go home and we have a few hours left in amsterdam so we're gonna explore i'm gonna bring my phone and get a few clips because i've just been failing so much because i haven't been taking this big camera but i'm gonna try to get some phone footage today for the few hours we have left here this is our hotel room it's really really pretty we have a view of the canals the water is so <laughs> brown. Wow, it's actually a really sunny day. Today. Uh, yesterday was rainy, but yeah, I think we're gonna try to go in a little boat in the canals today, since that's the thing to do. But this is our room. It's really, really nice and big. We had a little breakfast. This is my outfit of the day. I'm wearing this blue dress from Revolve. This is the only jacket I brought, so... Oh, 